What does this slingshot have to do with this week's space news? Stick around, because it's pretty exciting. Mm. Okay, and that <laughs> Remember the Europa Clipper? If you don't know, the Europa Clipper is a robotic spacecraft that was launched October 14th, 2024 to reach Jupiter's moon Europa. Once it gets there, the Clipper will perform numerous flybys to investigate the icy moon and its oceans underneath to determine if Europa could actually support life. Last year, when I visited NASA JPL, I was one of the last people who got to see the Europa Clipper before it was packed up and moved across the country for its launch from Kennedy Space Center in October. I wish I could have been there for the day of the launch, but it was still an exciting day. Three, Three two, two, one. Ignition and lift off. Lift off. Okay, back to this week's NASA news. On March 1st, the Europa Clipper will slingshot around Mars, getting a gravity assist, slowing it down and reshaping its orbit around the sun. In 2026, the Clipper will get another gravity assist from Earth that will slingshot away at a greater speed to get it to Jupiter's orbit in 2030. I know what you're thinking. Wouldn't it just be shorter to travel in a straight line? Yes, that's true, but it would be far too heavy to carry the fuel that they need to do that. By traveling this way and slingshotting around Mars and Earth, the Europa Clipper can change direction or get a speed boost without the need for fuel. To explain the gravity assist just a little bit more for anyone who might be confused, believe me, I was. Picture a skateboard going up a hill. When the skateboard is going up, gravity slows it down, which makes it a lot harder to get up the hill. However, when it goes down, gravity speeds it up. A spacecraft can take advantage of this to either slow down or speed up when it's flying past a planet or a large moon. When a spacecraft approaches a planet from the opposite direction of its orbit, the gravity assist will slow it down. However, if the spacecraft approaches the planet in the same direction as the orbit, it'll actually get a speed boost for free, which can be helpful for getting to where it actually needs to go. So on March 1st, Take a look at Mars in the sky and know that there's a cosmic game of slingshot going on right above your head. Thanks so much for taking a couple minutes with me as we hurtle through space together. This was Maisie Facts, Space News of the Week. Ah.